it's crazy. So one of the most hard things in life is to be happy. You know, sometimes you want to be happy, then you look yourself in the mirror and you realize you're ugly as fuck, then your happiness just goes away. Sometimes you want to be happy, but then you realize it's nearly summer and you haven't lost weight, then your happiness goes away. So how can we always be happy? Well, thank me, cause I've found a few ways we can be happy forever. I'm going to share 47 ways we can be happy forever. And here they are. The first way to be happy is to always masturbate. Every time you feel unhappy, just have a wank, masturbate. Most times when you're unhappy, it's cause you haven't shagged in a long time. So just masturbate. Another way to always be happy is to take drugs. Now, I'm not saying become an addict. I'm just saying do enough drugs to numb the pain and then leave them. Because if you do drugs all the time, you're just gonna end up a crackhead and crackheads are never happy. The third way to always be happy is to be single. Relationships are stressful. You're young, go out there, become a slag and suck dicks. Another way to always be happy is to smile at anything. Even if someone dies, just smile. Never let yourself be sad. I laughed when my granny died because I was in shock and um, I can never let something like death make me unhappy. So I smiled and laughed about it. Um, then I cried later on, but you know, it was tough, it was a hard time anyway. Another way to always be happy is to just be happy. You know, wake up in the morning and tell yourself, nothing's gonna make me sad today. Then force yourself to be happy the rest of the day. Even if you're in a relationship, just force yourself. I know it's gonna be harder, but force yourself. Another way to always be happy is to stop regretting stuff. If you cheated on your boyfriend with his best friend, yes, it happened, move on, man. Do not sit down and regret about it because it's probably out there shagging your best friend as well. The ninth way to be happy is to do fucked up shit. Doing fucked up shit keeps our mind stupid and young and when we were young, we were always happy. You can also be happy if you stop wasting time looking at other people and admiring them. Wake up in the morning, go in the mirror and admire yourself. There's nothing wrong in thinking you're the most good looking person on earth even when you're ugly as fuck. Another way to be happy is to avoid getting pregnant. If you're actually considering getting pregnant, then find someone that actually likes you and cares about you and they're not gonna leave you as soon as the baby pops out. But in everything, avoid getting pregnant because when you're pregnant, you have to go through nine months of pain um, and that will make you unhappy for nine months. To always be happy, you need to start talking shit about people you don't like. Talking shit about people you don't like releases the negative energy out of your mouth so it doesn't stay in. Because if it stays in, it will make you angry and then you'll be unhappy. Another way to always be happy is to find yourself a girlfriend or a boyfriend that's actually good in bed. If you have a deadbeat boyfriend or girlfriend, he or she is just going to waste your time. Shit sex is not worth sticking around for. Don't stick around with someone that's a deadbeat. Just message me and then I'll call give you the time of your life. To always be happy, girls, you need to find a man with a big dick. Fuck his big heart. You can't ride a big heart, but you can ride a big dick. Selling for small things like a small dick will always make you unhappy. So go out there and find yourself a nigger with a big dick and then fuck him till it falls off. If you also want to always be happy, you need to love yourself. You need to stop telling slags and fuckboys how you love them and tell it to yourself. Look in the mirror and tell yourself, I love you so much, Squeezy, whatever your name is. You love yourself and you reach to a point that you rather masturbate than have sex with someone else and that's what they call true love. You love yourself that you become a mock or a nan and you never want to have sex with anyone because people are disgusting and they don't shower and they don't brush their teeth. In order to always be happy, you need to become a bit of a slag. Most girls need attention, which slags always get. Most girls need sex, which slags always get. Most girls love to be treated like shit which most slags get. So being a slag will give you as a girl whatever you desired and you'll be happy. You can also always be happy if you brush your teeth. Cause if you don't brush your teeth, your breath will always stink. So you'll not laugh cause you don't want people to smell your stinky breath. Another way to always be happy is to look after yourself. Sometimes when you don't bathe, you feel unhappy cause you stink man. Just have a bath. Wash your stinky panani, then maybe you'll be happy as fuck. Another way to always be happy is to pretend that you're happy. 
Because when you pretend that you're something, you eventually become that something that you pretend to be. Another way to always be happy is to stop licking other people's asses, man. Say whatever you want, whether some slag will like it or not. Say what you feel at that time and forget about the consequences. Because if you keep licking other people's asses and saying what they want to hear, then you always be unhappy. If you're a girl, you can also always be happy forever if you get an implant. Periods make girls unhappy. But if you get an implant, you can be a slug without limitation and you'll be happy. If you're a boy, you can always be happy if you find something to do for yourself rather than going out clubbing and standing around waiting for girls. Don't be that guy man, just stay at home, you know, save, build something for yourself. Then once you're loaded and you have your cash, go out there and change girls and mess around with them and then throw them away like socks. I know it's tight but that's how it works. Another way to always be happy is to drink less coffee. Drinking coffee will make your teeth brown, which will make you not want to smile because you don't want people to see your brown teeth. Another permanent way to always be happy is to kill yourself. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. It's not advisable, obviously, but if you're tired of leaving, then I'm joking, I'm joking. I don't know why I said that. Probably should not have said that. Don't kill yourself. No one deserves to kill themselves. Life is good. There is hope in the world. Another way to always be happy is to never kill yourself. Be happy, okay? Another way to always be happy is to put yourself before anyone else. Sometimes when you put others before yourself, it makes you feel unworthy, unhappy. You feel like shit, you know? So always put yourself before everyone else, then everyone else can feel like shit, but you'll be happy. Another way to always be happy is to stay away from your siblings. Siblings tend to be so annoying. You put your food in the fridge and then you go to work thinking about it, and then you come home and your little piece of shit of a sister has eaten your food. I, I hate siblings. So if you have those type of siblings that eat your food without your permission, just wait till it's dark at night and randomly push them downstairs. They might break a bone or something, hopefully die. Don't throw your siblings downstairs. In order to be happy is to chill with happy people. Cut off all them unhappy friends with their bad breath. Because if they're unhappy, they probably don't talk a lot to other people. And if you don't talk a lot, you end up having bad breath. Also, if you want to be happy, it's advisable to always think positive all the time. Another way to always be happy is to always get pissed with friends, but only on weekends. Getting pissed with friends on the weekend will always give you something to look forward when you're going through a tough week. Another way to always be happy is to stop smoking. Smoking makes your breath stink, which makes you feel like a person with stinky breath which makes you unhappy. Girls, you can also be happy forever if you stay away from fat boys. Fat boys will sleep with your best friend and send you pictures which might give you a heart attack and you die. So if you see a fat boy or you get with a fat boy, just spike his drink with bleach, tiny bit of bleach, let him die and you move on with your life. I'm joking. If you want to always be happy forever, stop posting everything about your life on social networks because if you post all your pictures online you always feel unhappy and you always feel insecure and that will make you feel like terrible man just don't post stuff about your life always on social networks it will make you paranoid you feel like everyone knows you so try not to post naked pictures of yourself like just keep them for your future husband you'll also always be happy if every once and then you do something nice for someone else other than yourself. Maybe go out and feed the pigeons or the ducks, or maybe go out and fuck someone that's ugly as fuck, because if you shag someone that's ugly as fuck, you're doing that person a favor, and that's good. Another way to always stay happy is to surround yourself with crackheads. Now, you don't have to become a crackhead. You just have to surround yourself with them. Crackheads always do some funny, weird, as fuck shit, which always keep you happy and keep you smiling and laughing all the time. Like all my friends are crackhead, so I'm just always laughing, I'm always happy. It's, it's a nice environment. Another way to always be happy is to actually pay people you owe money and um, so you don't fall back in debt. Because if you're in debt, you avoid people and when you avoid people, it means you don't have friends and if you don't have friends, you always be unhappy. Another way to always be happy is to become a fuck boy. Being a fuck boy means you don't chase these girls. Chasing girls can make you tired and unhappy. But if you're a fuck boy, you don't have to do all that. You just chill at home, work on yourself, build your empire, and then the girls will come flooding in. 
Another way to always be happy is to be shady as fuck. When you're shady as fuck, no one can be shady with you. And you also know how to make people give you what you want, which will make you happy. Girls, if you want to be happy, always be happy. You have to become a gold digger. Gold diggers always get what they want, even if there is a risk of getting chlamydia or something, but they get what they want, which makes them happy. To also always be happy is to compliment people. So if you see a girl with big tits, go over, touch them and tell her she has big tits. You might get arrested for sexual harassment, but that doesn't matter as long as you're happy. Girls, if you see a guy with a big dick or a dick showing out in the joggers or sweatpants he's wearing, just go touch it and then tell him um, you have a big dick. Um, you won't get arrested for sexual harassment because you're a girl. And it's only, it's only sexual harassment when guys do it. Sadly, yeah. Another way to be happy is to always mind your business. Don't get nosy with people's shit. So if you know your man is cheating, don't get nosy. Just let him be. Don't go around checking his phone. You're just gonna find stuff that's going to make you unhappy. So just leave your cheating man cheat on you and you sit back and mind your own business and you'll be happy. Another way to always be happy is to stop being a little sensitive piece of shit. Don't be that person that anything and everything pisses them off. You know, be that person that you just hear stuff, hear that, see that, and just move on. Nothing gets to you. Don't be that guy that starts arguments over the smallest thing about this and that. And that doesn't always be happy is to face your fear. When we face our fears, we become stronger and fearless. So if you're scared of getting an STD, go out there and get an STD. Then that'll make you fear less and strong and you'll have an STD. <laughs> you might die, but you'll be happy because you've conquered your fear, <laughs> okay? Another way to be happy is to thank God. Thank God for everything. Thank God for your fuckboy boyfriend. Thank God for the drugs. Thank God for anything. Thank God for the shit you're going through as well. Just be thankful to God, whatever you're going through. Even if your man cheated on you, God wanted it to happen. Just be thankful. Even if someone dies, a relative, God wanted it to happen. Just thank God, you know? You have to be thankful to God 